I'm a freelance here in Angela City. Um, I came here in Angela City since um, 2010 um, <clears throat> to freelance and I live here so many years and I, I like this place because um, so many foreigners, so many tourists, they they are looking for a um, um, they're looking for a short time and long time. Yeah. Also, I, I, I really need to to find money to support my family in province because um, in, in my province, my parents is so poor, they can't even buy food to feed, to feed me and my other brother and sister. So, so I came here to support them. Because I'm a breadwinner of my family, and also <clears throat> I have oh, one baby now, and the father of my son is a foreigner. Also, he don't support me, so I really need to work hard here to support my son. Yeah, most of my customers <clears throat> is sometimes they are so rude to me. They, they. They do. They want me to do anything for them, like um, having sex with um, vibrator and so many things. They they tied me up in the bed and they fuck me hard. But sometimes I don't like what I'm doing. But uh, I I don't know what to do. But because of the money, so I I take everything what they want from me. And also. I, I experience a lot of hardship in life when I stay here. Sometimes I earn much money. Sometimes um, I don't have anything. Yeah, because um, being freelance is not that easy. I really need to stay until morning in walking street to find a guy to like me and take me to his hotel room. So. <clears throat> Um, sometimes I tell to my to myself that I can I can do everything just for the sake of money. So that's it. <laughs> okay. But kaya nagiwale ng for foreign asawa mo. Um, kaya nagiwale because uh when my my foreigner boyfriend the father of my son and me got separated um, after he was pregnant me he ran away and he did not support my son so so I try I, I try my best to find him and it, it's hard to find him because I don't know where he is right now yeah, I, I even don't know what his name. I, I forgot everything because he is just my customer before. And... Ilang taon na yung anak mo? My, my son age is 2 years old. Yeah, boy. Yung mama at papa mo, nasan sila ngayon? My parents, they are both died when I was a little kid in my province so I came here alone by myself mga kapatid mo sino nag-aalaga ngayon um my brother and sister they are having their own family now mm. pero sino supportahan mo pa rin sila yeah i i support my brother and sister mm. i sometimes i send them small money if i have extra money mm. ilang kayo magkakapatid um uh, my, my, I have two brothers and one sister, but my my other brother is disabled. He can't walk in, in the province. And my my other sister, um, she's working in Dubai for uh, OFW, but she, she is TNT there. She can't go back home. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I I, I have a I have a um, others brother too. Um, she died when I, I was a little, yeah, by accident, car accident. 
Ano yung pinaka-pinaka nakakatakot mo naranasan sa customer mo? Um, before I remember when I had a customer, um, uh, white American, um, uh, he, he bar find me in Dalhouse bar before, and then he take me to his hotel room, and then he throw me to to his bed, and he he rip he rip off my clothes, and he he told me to to use some cocaine like that yeah but but I, I i really don't like it so i was so scared because the first time i saw it i know i know it's like um kind of um very addictive yes something like that and then he raped me and he fucked me hard like that no yeah. pinagamit ka niya gumamit ka uh yeah i tried it once but uh after mm-hmm. that i i did not do it again yeah Mm-mm. Ngayon wala ka nang wala kang live-in ngayon. Uh, I I don't have uh, I don't mm-hmm. have other boyfriend. I'm single. Mm. Mm-hmm. Ano pa ha ka? Yeah, I I renting a small apartment just enough for me and my son. Sino nag-aalaga sa anak mo? Mm. My my son, I just leave him to the babysitter, my neighbor friend. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but they don't ask me to pay them. Just they help me to look out my son. Before I came here in Angeles City, in in way back in the province, when when I was a little kid, I I experienced to become a street children in Manila. I was begging for money to buy food, and I get food from the garbage. I eat it because before. When when I was six years old, my parents, my mother died in cancer, so, and then and then then my father <clears throat> was in accident. <clears throat> she she was being killed by someone. So I grew up alone in Manila. Mm-hmm. Pinatay yung nanay mo, chatatay mo. Mm-hmm. No, my my mother died in cancer, and then my father di- died in. Ano, gun, gunshot. Yeah, someone... Binaril siya? Mm-mm, someone killed my father. Yeah, in Manila. Nahuli naman yung bumarag sa kanya? No. So, the... Ano, they, they did not capture the killer. Mm. Yeah, so... I grew up alone without parents. I, I grew up in the street in Manila. Ilan taon ka na no? Six years old. Yeah. I always beg for money. Pero tanda, pandan tanda mo. Yeah, I, I, mo. I remember everything what happened to my parents. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So until now, may trauma pa rin sayo. Yes, it, I have a trauma until now. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then after in Manila, I I try I I re- I realized that um Every time I, I think about my parents, um, I need to be strong because if I will not be strong, n- no one will be there for me, no one, because I know no one will take care of me, I don't have parents. And then, um, one foreigner I saw in Luneta Park and then she asked me, she asked me if um, I can do um, massage and then I try to, to do it but um, he take me to to her hotel room, but when I go there in the hotel room, I saw another um person there. It's a guy, um and then that American guy, and then he start to fuck me in the hotel room. Two guy? Yeah, one guy and one girl. Yeah, maybe they are a couple, but they they want to to have other. You mean yeah. you mean threesome? Yeah, threesome. Yeah. And then that guy fucked me in the bed. That's that's the time they get my virginity, because mm. I was six years old before. Ila magkano binayad sa yun? Ano nakuha niya yung virginity? Yeah, mo? they they pay me four thousand. Hmm? Yeah. And then yeah, first time I experienced like that having sex with a foreigner. Paano mo nalaman yung trabaho dito? 
Paano ka natuto dito? Because uh, that guy told me about this place, so I'm curious to know about that. So I I can I come here alone by myself. Father ng baby mo? Hmm, no, other other guy. Other foreign. Oh. Then when I came here in Angeles, I was walking down in walking street and and I I was begging for food again for all all the people. I begged money for food and then I sleep on outside outside the the bar and then one mama sang saw me there and sh she asked me if i can dance and because she want me to apply in the dollhouse bar so that's the first time when i apply in dollhouse bar i i start my work as dancer and then i got my first customer a japanese and he bar find me and then the, he gave me um um tip because I can, I go to with him in the hotel room. So after that I have bar fine by a Japanese and then I told to my mama sang I want to stop to work in the bar because I don't want it because um I'm so scared before. Yeah, mm. because it's my first time. Then may na trauma ka. Yeah. So yeah, after that when <clears throat> after working in the bar I'm I work in in small carinderia, you know, Philippine, ano, Philippine food. small restaurant. Yeah, so I work there as dishwasher, I cleaner, uh, I do everything. And then they gave me free home, free food, and then like that. But s somehow I heard from other girls that they they easily can earn money by doing a freelance if they always go to customer they can have more money to support their family so because of that i heard from other girls so i i try it so i always do what they do yeah so that i can have what they have they can buy clothes they can buy everything i want i want to buy everything also so because of that i I want to become a freelance too, like them. Yeah, um, uh, I want to say more, but um, next time. <laughs> so for now, um, that is all I can say. So I, I hope you, you also um, <laughs> um, wait for my next video. I will tell you everything more about my my life. For now, um, that is uh, enough for now. Okay, thank you.